Hello and welcome guys, today we have another episode of Stealth or Try Hard and no, um, this is just, just an episode of Stealth or Try Hard. I wanted to record some x Arc, but then I was like, nah, I really, I really don't have like the mental power to do an x Arc recording like with commentary right now. So I'm sorry, you'll just have to make do with me, um, making a... Like, uh, with the blaster, and I have quite the gimmicky set, which I really like, and I'll show you guys, because I'm, I'm quite proud of it. And it's basically all swim speed, except for ninja squid, and now you could say, oh, you have one, um, s um, quick super jump. That's because I am used to running it with these shoes, that has uh, a lot of, uh, that has both stealth jump and all swim speed but I will not be using them today because it's stealth 4 and I don't need to stealth jump so I'm just going full gimmick as much swim speed as I can and ninja squid and I'll see you in the games okay let's go first game of Kindle Dome um, actually blaster can be fun because uh, it's really easy to get targets on the grades so yeah Oops, um, today we are using as, like, as much as my uh, GPU, like, lags a bit, and means that I drop frames whenever I record, because it can tell the, um, 1080s are well, 1080s, 60s are well, um, we are going to use RTX voice today. Woo! I know, I know, you are all excited as much as I am. So hopefully there will not be any weird background noises today. Um, because having to deal with uh, background noises. Didn't see me. No, what did you? Please, oh damn, I'm dead, okay. Fine, whatever, whatever, we, we don't care. Was I a squid? I don't think that one is squid one. So, what I'm trying to do right now with the ninja squid is that actually I have uh, I played Bluetooth recently with my team and the other like team one of the players was a player that it was like a one gimmick start and he, the stats was um, Ninja Squid with Clapples. And unfortunately for us, he was actually really decent at this gimmick strat. Obviously, like, that won't do, that won't be any good in like high rank since there you probably know how to like um, abuse it better. But us as like, let's say lower level, we, we kind of struggle against him. Well, because the... I'm so not dead yet, wow. What are you doing? You're just waiting for me to kill me. Ah, <laughs> the fizzy bomb bounced off this one tiny pole and managed to come back at me. That's funny. Yeah. So, anyway, um, I have... Because, obviously, like a good player that I am, I watched the vote of his stream because apparently he streamed. So I just really wanted like a piece of trying to look like how um, the other team saw the matches against us. Um, I uh, I was really interested in that. So yeah, um, I watched it and. Um, I kind of learned actually quite a lot from watching him playing Ninja Squid all of the time. So I'm trying to uh, use what I learned from him playing it to to this video. And I don't know. Unfortunately, that is a loss. But I did quite alright actually. So I want to blame teammates. And I feel like I am entitled. I, I feel like I can do that. Anyway, on to the next game. Ooh, another kill dome, damn. So, I did a warm up 
before starting the recording, as you would. Um, and I actually, I got a decent chunk of like games in Makomart, which is the other map. So I'm guessing now I am getting my chunk of uh, Kiltown. So yeah, something that actually has a uh, ninja squid. No, die there. Um, but yeah, something that I always forget whenever I play Ninja Squid is that I need to be less good because I've grown actually quite accustomed to to sub strafing because it just it's it's easy, uh, it, like it's relatively speaking easy, and it makes like your movement that much better. Oh yeah, I figured it was the spider shot. Nope. No, ah, he got me. That was, I was in quite the tight situation there. Anyway, so. Yeah, like not needing to substrate. It's uh it's weird, really like after getting used to it you just just kind of go with the flow, you know. Wait, is there not someone here? I guess not. I really thought there was. Oh that's where he is. Oof, easy kill. Haha <laughs> Um Yeah. There is always a, an interesting perspective to watching. Uh, there's always okay. Uh, let me rephrase that. There is always something interesting in watching the games that you played from other perspective. Okay. Um, it's the probably the other hill. I don't really want to get that close to him. Yeah, okay, so the roller is last. Oh, and that's where he is. Got him. Yeah, so... Um... I don't know, man, I kind of run out of things to talk about, and I'm going full try and I am fully concentrated in the game. So... I hope that you don't mind, like, my less than usual commentary. Um, because I really like, as the name suggests, this is tough or tryhard, and I was going full tryhard to get this win, which we got, so I'm really happy, actually. <laughs> that, that was, I, I, like, Blaster with Ninja Squid, everyone knows it's really good, but I'm surprised how much I can abuse it in Telf while, well, I can turf, and Telf is what allows me to be cheeky with Ninja Squid. Anyway, rambling on at the end of the game like a fucking idiot, on to the next one. And, ooh, yeah, we got Makumart, okay, great. So, um, while waiting for the lobby to get filled and having um, um, to actually get into the game, there was something that I noticed, which was the fact that I was the only one um, in the lobby who was above level 100. Now, technically I'm level 200 and something, but still, I was the only one with like a style of you've made it over 100. Um, and that kind of made me think of like... Um, damn, I don't think like in any of the previous game too I had that much... Like, that many players. Oh my god, I can't speak right now. I didn't have that many players on level 100 as well. So... What's the jig with that? And then I realized something that was more interesting, which I haven't abused actually at all, which I wanted to, which was the fact that, uh, like, about a week ago, I'm dead, yeah, but I don't remember how long that was, but there was a new, like, Splatoon demo, which this is the second time it happened, and again, I completely forgot to abuse the system, like, 
So the beautiful thing about the the ah, I forgot I had splashed up. Um, the beautiful thing about the demo, whoa, I've been got, is the fact that you basically get a free Smurf account for like a period of a week, which is amazing because fucking content, man. Think think about how many noobs I can I can I can laugh on when when playing on the same level as them. Like all I need to do is pretend that I'm a noob for a couple of games so that the game doesn't put me in like high level lobbies. And that's it, I got content for days. But every fucking time I forget to do that. So what I'm left with No. Why is he? No! Mm! <laughs> Anyway, so yeah, I wanted to abuse the system, and I didn't. Now I'm sad. And the worst thing is, uh, you're probably, I actually I don't know, but I'm going to say that you probably do know a YouTuber by the name Big Beyond. I don't have Splashdown, I don't have Splashdown. Um, but she does a lot of like more casual Splatoon content, but she does know like um, her fair chunk of like competitive play, right? She's decent. Um, and she made a video on that. And I was like, oh my god, I forgot to make a video. And the thing that I was kind of angry about in the video is the fact that she didn't abuse the system like I wanted to do. So, oh, okay, that's game. Anyway, I was kind of sad because it wasn't what I expected from someone who would like meme on the demo. But anyway, that was a that was a weird game. Yeah, I guess low-level players play weird. Ooh, he got ten kills for the Swiffer. Damn. Um. Well, that that is it for today's episode. I uh, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye.